today we are going to see a combinational circuit with three input and three output and the output is when the binary input is 0, 1, 2, 3 the output is 1 greater than input okay. and when the binary output is 4, 5, 6, 7 when the binary input is 4, 5, 6, 7 the output is 1 less than the input this is a 3 input, 3 output and <coughs> this is the truth table truth table I have just now written in order to reduce the timing this is the question okay. now 3 input therefore I have taken A, B, C as 3 input and 3 output I have te taken X, Y, Z as output 3 input mean you know the combination from 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1 that means 0 to 7 2 power 3 therefore 8 combinations are there now 8, 8 input mean 8 outputs are there now what is the condition when the input is 0, 1, 2, 3 the output is 1 greater than the input now for this combination let us check first input the first input is 0, 0, 0 the output is 1 greater than the input that means when it is 0, the output is 0, 0, 1. When the input is 1, 0, output is 1. When the input is 1, output is 2. When the input is 2, output is 3. When the input is 3, output is 4. Okay. This is the first line, first condition. And second is, when the input is 4, 5, 6, 7. That means 4, 5, 6, 7. The output is less than 1 of the input. Now, 1, 0, 0. This is 4. Then the output should be 3. Therefore, 0, 1, 1. And when it is 1, 1, 1, 7, the output is 6. Okay. Now, for this truth table, we have to design a circuit, a combinational circuit. Okay. Already you know what is meant by a combinational circuit. Combinational circuit is a circuit which generates output for its input. It is different from sequential circuit. Okay. Sequential circuit means it depends upon the input as well as previous output. Now here it depends upon the input only. Okay. Now to <coughs> design a circuit, we have to write an equation. How to write an equation? There are three outputs are there. Therefore, we go to go for a 3 equation. Now, for this x, 1, 2, 3, 4 ones are there. That means 4 min terms are there. Now, we go to add 4 min terms and we go to solve it. Okay. I am not going to write the equation because it is very fundamental. Therefore, I am directly going to write a cam up. Okay. Now, I erase this. For x I am going to write, for x I am going to write, therefore a bar b bar, a bar b, a b, a b bar, c bar c, okay, for 3 variable came out. Now you know the position value, again I am just uh, to remind you I am writing. This is 0, this is 1, this is 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That means these are all the cell value. Okay. Cells decimal, decimal number value. Now I am going to substitute the 1 in the proper cells. Okay. Now for 0, the output of x is 0. Therefore, this is 0 and for 1 output of x is 0 therefore this is 0 and for 2 also it is 0 therefore this is 0 0 1 2 and 3 we have 1 for 3 we have 1 that means 3 we have 1 okay and 4 we are having 0 this is 4 0 and 5 we have 5 6 7 we have 1 Therefore, this is 5, this is 6, this is 7. Now, 
four volts are there, this one and this one, this one, this one. Four volts are there, we have substituted four volts. Now we have to group this, okay, and we have to write an equation. Now this is the first group, therefore equation for x is, equation for x is AB plus, and we can go for this group, we can go for this group. That means here B and C, therefore this is BC. Okay, already we know how to write an equation in the camera, therefore I am straight away writing this. And here for this, this is AC, therefore plus AC. This is the equation for X. Okay, I will erase this and I am writing here. X equals AB plus BC plus AC. Okay. Now we have to substitute for Y. I erase this. This is for Y. Now for Y, for 0 it is 0. Okay. For decimal 0, Y value is 0. Therefore this 0. Therefore this is 0. And for 1 it is 1. Therefore 1. And for 2 it is 1. It is 1. And for 3 it is 0. 3 it is 0. Okay. And for 4 it is 1. This is 4. Therefore 4 it is 1. And 5 it is 0. It is 0. 6, 0, 7, 1. Okay. 7, 1. Now, see here. By looking this table, we can easily understand this is a simply ex exact gate. It is simply a exact gate. See, alternate numbers are 1. Alternate numbers are 1. Therefore, equation for Y is A XR B XR C. 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0. If it is like this, then it is a definitely exact gate. Therefore, equation for Y is A XR B XR C. Therefore, I can write here y equal to a x r b x r c. Okay. Now I can go for z. That. Now z. Okay. Now for 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 0. For this 1, it is 0. And for 2, it is 1. And for 3, 0. And 4, 1. 5, 0. 6, 1. 7, 0. Okay. Now, this is a quad. The combination is quad. Therefore, z equal to c bar. z equal to z bar. Sorry, c bar. z equal to c bar. Now, we have three equations. Now, we have to... Design circuit. Three inputs are there. Therefore, A input, B input, C input. I will take three inputs lines. Okay. Now, first equation is a, B, B, C, A, C. Therefore, three AND gates we can use and OR gate also we can use. Therefore, one AND gate, another AND gate, another AND gate. Okay. First is connected to A and B, A, B. Okay. And second is B, C. Second is B, C. This is B and this is C. Third is A, C. A, C. You have to mark a dot here, okay? Dot, dot. Then only, otherwise, this is a line crossing. Therefore, then only we can understand from which point it is connected or which is the input it is connected. Therefore, A, B, and B, C, A, C. Now, all the three AND gates are there. Now, we have to R it. We have to R it. Therefore, you put a R gate. You put a R gate. While drawing the circuit, these all should be in a straight line. 
okay all the three angles should be straight line and this is equal to here and you have to draw like this in a straight line generally it looks very neatly okay now this output is x output this output is x output then y and y is a x or b x or c therefore you can directly go for a xor gate therefore you can connect xor gate here you can connect xor gate here okay then it is y xor gate a xor b na therefore a and b and it is c and z is c bar therefore this is c you straight away connect with the not gate and this is c z okay now this are all the input this are all the output now the outputs are generating as desired by the equation okay as required by the equation that means for 0 to 3 it generates one greater than the input and for 4 5 6 7 it generate one less than the input now using the gates we have written but we can draw in some other way also How, that means this is a carry equation for a full ladder and this is a sum equation for the full ladder therefore in different way also i can draw this is a correct circuit and in some other form also i can draw therefore i will draw that also because by writing the equation you can know full ladder okay full ladder we have three inputs a b c a b c and x is the x is the carry and y is the sum therefore this is the sum equation this is the carry equation okay now sum is your y therefore this is y this is x this is x this is a carry this is a carry okay and here for is a c bar therefore you take a line here and you put a not gate here you put a not gate here then it is z okay and you can write you can change this also you can change this also as this is if you want x y z in the order you can change it is not a problem you can change here x you can change here y then x will be this will be carry this will be your carry this will be your sum okay this also a simple form okay now this is a combinational circuit for the required equation thank you